Hi! What's going on guys? My name is Ryan Snod. It rhymes with odd and welcome to another video. In this video we're going to be talking about why I got a new computer chair for my desk. We're going to unbox it, show you guys all of the good stuff about it, and talk about some of the pros and cons of getting a new desk chair. So, before we do that though, I just realized I have a Zoom call with a client in like five minutes, so we're going to do that first and then we'll get to the unboxing. So, make sure to like the video. We'll talk to you soon. Okay, so the chair that I got is the Tacova Ergonomic Mesh Chair. Let's get a knife and cut this open. Oh. Clearly not the most uh, clean unboxing here. We've got parts everywhere, so I'm gonna put this together and we'll see how it looks in a bit. pretty comfy. Um, the only thing is this plastic piece makes some noise. I could easily screw that in a little tighter, but these shift around. There's lumbar support, which is nice, and I can just spin this little dial and adjust that. The headrest is nice. I can already see myself editing. So we'll check back in in a couple weeks and see if uh, I still like it, but... Oh! Hey, I didn't see you there. Okay, well, it's been, gosh, what, like three days since I got this chair set up. So overall feedback is very good. It's well worth the 250 bucks or so that it costs. Um, I was comparing this chair to other chairs that were in the $1,000 range, $2,000 range. So I think in terms of lumbar support, headrest support, um, armrest, and just overall comfortability, it's really good. Biggest thing that I liked about it was the back mesh here, which dissipates the uh heat coming out of my body throughout the day so um i do wish that it was kind of meshed throughout the bottom but i do like the cushion of the actual seat so that's nice um only other feedback that i have is that i do wish the arms folded back forward so i didn't have the arm rest just so i could support my arms better and not just have my elbows constantly fixated here um i noticed just by having a broken lumbar support in my last chair um it does take a toll on your body over time so Take care of your low back, get a chair with lumbar support like that. The only addition that I did make, which I mentioned to you earlier, the first day when I got this chair was the little metal piece on the bottom would cling around. So I added some gaff tape, which is lighting tape that I use on productions. So I'll link that up in the description box below as well. Um, it's just like no stick duct tape basically that I put on the inside of the metal ring on the bottom. So it doesn't shake around and make noise when I move in the chair. I can stand up, sit up, down it doesn't uh make any noise or jingle around so that was the only addition that i made overall the chair took an hour to build and put together so there is a process in that but i mean for the price it's a pretty good chair i would say uh it holds up for the last couple of days my back has been feeling better i feel comfortable and uh, not as sweaty because like i said the mesh chair back lets the heat come out of the back a little bit so overall good chair uh, i think i'll keep it uh, that about does it for this video so if you like the video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you want to check out the chair and other stuff in my office setup, feel free to check out my kit, which I will link up in the description box below. But that about does it for me, guys. My name is Ryan Snod. It rhymes thawed, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.